Hello everybody, Ghosty here, and today I'm going to be showcasing my cheat table for Real Steel WRB. Um, this includes a method to hack this game without having to download anything sketchy, no sketchy APKs, and you're able to play online and have full functionality to the recent versions um, when using this method. Um, this also includes a way to customize anything that you're doing. Um, and basically get everything for free. Um, the reason I created this was because the prices for this game are pretty bad. I mean, you can go into the store and see that they're pretty unfair for what they're asking. Uh, $200 for in-game robots is kind of lucrative. So I designed a cheat table in order to prevent people from having to spend money on this game until they eventually end up fixing it. So. All you're going to need for this tutorial is a PC. You're going to need to have blue stacks with real steel WRB on it. And then you're going to need cheat engine, which I will have a link in the description for, as well as the cheat table I've created. Um, so once you go ahead and have all that downloaded, you'll be able to start this process. Um, and do keep in mind, you can also transfer all of the data on your pc to your mobile device so if you hack all of this on here you can always transfer it back to mobile via facebook and you will have all of your stats so without further ado let's go ahead and get into it um, you're going to need to first off open the table from the download and then it'll look something like this it'll have this little main injection at the bottom and at the top, it'll ask you to execute the release script. Say yes. All that's doing is just setting up the table, um, doing some prerequisite functions to enable some stuff. Um, so, yep. And it's going to ask you if you'd like to inject the main script. Say yes. It's going to attach the process for you if you have BlueStacks open. And it will look a little something like this. So now that we have the table loaded, let's go ahead and get into the kind of functionality of the table. Um, here are the credits. And if you want to click on this right here, it'll pull up the main website for you to go and look at. So with the helpers, um, I have a list of functions down here. Um, this, if you quit out of the emulator, when you come back in you can always just press this button right here if you still have the cheat table running and it'll automatically at attach the process for you um, this is a info table or info parent that will kind of just describe um, if something's able to be changed or not uh, with a key over here and then here are the anti-cheat rules, which I will briefly go over here in a moment. Um, but for now, I'm going to kind of skip over that. Um, and then here are the reward pools for the gold, for the bronze and gold, which I don't really have silver because it's not needed. Um, I'll, I'll kind of show you why I have only both of these. Um, and that'll come important later as to why I have them mapped out like this so there's also some other info here you can come down and visit so let's go ahead and get into how to actually start hacking so it's pretty simple um, all you have to do is just start off with as long as you don't change anything related to the um, gold value now I do have a anti-cheat rules like a it state it will kind of summarize what you can or what you can't do um, otherwise your account will get flagged um, so be careful if you are on your Facebook account um, just make sure you read over this so yeah once you have read over that just be cognizant of it I will also go over it throughout the video um, so what we're gonna go and do is we're gonna start off by changing our Currency, and I'm gonna go ahead and show you how this kind of works. So you're gonna come over to the scanner, the cheat engine, and you're going to 
select the value type and you're going to come down and see real steel decrypted integer and you're going to press that and you're going to then enter your value so minus five two six eight and then we're going to say click scan and you see we have a total um, value selection here from all the values it's found we can go over to mystery draw and spend some coins and it will find the correct value since there are not many values in the game that have the or decryption or i'm sorry the encryption on it um, so once you have searched for that and when you found it you can come over here and make sure again this is in the decrypted integer value type and then you can come over here and enter whatever you want okay so once you have done that you can get rid of the value by either right clicking on it or just in delete on your keyboard and come over here to the stats viewer and as you can see the value has changed so pretty simple way to get the coins um, and of course you can then now buy anything you want with coins um, but the real question is how do we get unlimited gold because that is pretty much the most important part of the game the most important currency because if you don't have that you can't really get the best stuff well I have a solution for you so there's a system built around um, how gold works in this game since this game has been out for a while they the developers at Relance have kind of caught on to the fact that people just like to change shit related to the gold counter um, and they have found or they have created a protection system which essentially can be found over here the anti-cheat rules and you can do it right here um so if you have over 5,000 gold then it's going to flag your account automatically it doesn't matter um how much you gained if you have over 5,000 then you're gonna get if you gain over 1500 in a single pool of the reward then you're also going to get um, and you can always do more research on this this is just what i have found through my time of the game so in saying that there are a couple of things we can do um, to basically get anything we want so the first way is to come to the robot section let's say i really really wanted golden zeus Okay, 800 gold as you can see I don't have that <laughs> I only have one gold so what we can do is we can come over here and we can make use of the value modification strips um, section on my cheat table so come over here and we can press on this and then we're going to start off by searching for 800 do that and we're going to select all of these and then add them to the list on the cheat table and then we're going to click this saying append all with no description okay and then once we have done that we're going to come over here to the large scale value modifier and then we are going to be asked what we want to change all the values to which i'm just going to say for right now yep so once we have done that we can go ahead and refresh the page and we see that zeus is now or direction golden zeus now is only one golden coin which is awesome so we can go ahead and purchase that don't mind if i do and now we officially have golden zeus for the price of one coin um, and once you are done the cleanup is as simple as pressing this button right here and it will restore all the correct values so that no crashes occur so with that being said that is essentially the first way on how to get whatever you want um, and this can be used for anything uh, pretty much so the second way is to modify the mystery draw um, which can be done very simply uh, we can come over here and the best way I've found to do it is to search for one and then add all of these to the 
a cheat table selection list and then we're going to search for three then we're going to say new scan and then we're going to scan again and we're going to add all those to the table and then we're going to append all with no description and then we're going to change all of these to 1500 now the name of the game now is as you can see the prize pool is now 1500 for a goal selection so you can spin this as much as you want and you can end up getting yourself 1500 gold just from one prize as i said this is the max you can earn um, in one time so do not go over 1500 otherwise your account will get flat so i will be right back whenever i have gotten the amount of gold that i want all right so i am back and i have gotten the max amount of gold that i can possibly get um through the mystery draw um now this can kind of depend on your luck but it's not that hard to get a hit um so once you get 1500 three times you end up uh, having 4500 and then you can just set all the values to what you need to even out to 5000 so once you have spent all of your um, mystery draws and you've gotten what you want, you can change the values back by simply unchecking the script and it'll do everything for you. Um, then you can go ahead and come in and basically spend all this gold that we earn for free. No payments to the developers, no nothing the prices are ridiculous so I'm gonna upgrade Zeus our golden Zeus fully so I just do that and like, like that we now have a fully upgraded Zeus which is awesome and we can go take this into whatever we want if we wanted a Adam fully upgraded Adam we can come over here to the world one and come by Adam, the upgrades too, and we can upgrade them uh, just like that. And we will still have a ton of gold left over to buy whatever we want inside of the game. So, with that being said, thank you everybody for watching. I appreciate it. Um, if you have any questions in the comments regarding how any of this works, please let me know. If you have any discoveries at all, also leave them in the comments. I would greatly appreciate the feedback as well on the table. So, Thank you all for watching. See ya.